This is one of seven videos presenting the units of learning outcomes developed through the PIRATE project. Please also watch the introduction video about Earth Building and our European project. Equate Earth Building is a matrix of nine units of learning outcomes designed to create new teaching content and certifications. Building with Earth is building the future. Get the skills. Unit P is the Equit Earth Building Unit, covering skills for producing prefabricated elements like bricks, blocks, panels, slabs. Prefabrication means setting up a production line where a mix is used to make multiple elements, which are then cured, dried, stored and packed. In Earth construction, we try to reduce transport distances before and after production to minimize embodied energy. Prefabrication is a strategy in modern earth building which reduces delays due to on-site drying and handling of huge quantities of mix. This speeds up and simplifies the construction process. But, in fact, earthen bricks are as old as human settlements. The first prefabricated construction materials indeed. In this video, we focus on bricks, but there is a growing range of innovative prefabricated earthen panels and light blocks. In the European construction market, three technologies are used to make bricks, and these are Adobe are made by filling a plastic or almost liquid mix into molds, either single or multiple. Extruded bricks are made of soft or stiff mix pushed through a die. Compressed earth blocks are made like rammed earth from a moist mix compressed into a mold with a manual or mechanical press. In all three types, once shaped, the bricks need to dry. Whatever the technology, brick production generally involving a production line with a mixing area, a shaping area, space for cure, for drying, and finally a storage zone. The job at the different workstations may be done by a single person or by a team. In Adobe production, there are many different manual and mechanical ways to fill the molds. Filling may be done on a table or on the floor. The molds are prepared to facilitate demolding. And the surface receiving the bricks also needs to be prepared. No voids should be created while putting the mix into the form. The top of the brick is leveled and the mold immediately removed. During the first stage of the drying process, it is essential to avoid deforming the fresh adobe. From the table, the fresh adobes are transported to drying racks. They need to stay on a board until they are dry and hard enough to be handled without deforming. On the floor, adobes are turned on edge as soon as they are hard to allow drying on all sides. The workers assess the drying stage by touch and tapping. On simple and manual production lines, a person can make 100 adobe a day. Hand tech today can also be groundbreaking. Thousands of years old adobe technology is far from being used to its full creative design potential in today's architecture. Fired brick production develop extruded bricks. Large and small brick factories have started adapting their mixes to produce unburnt earth bricks. The mix is spilled into the hopper of a machine, which creates a long extrusion or sausage with the desired width and depth. This is then cut into bricks of the desired length. When bricks meant to be fired are used unburned, they are called green bricks. These are usually quite sensitive to water and should be used with caution. CEB machines were updated in the mid-20th century and it allowed the widespread diffusion of the technique. Several types of press exist. Manual presses are usually operated by two people. Much larger industrial machines exist. The mix is set with a grain size distribution allowing for maximum density after compression. A measuring device is used to fill in the correct quantity of mix. A long hand-operated lever drives a cam, generating high pressure. The press lifts the brick out of the mold. It is carefully carried and stacked for drying. Very often, CEB blocks are stabilized with 3 to 10% of lime or cement. 
In that case, the blocks require a humid cure to allow the chemical binder to work. After the first cure, the blocks are ready for drying. Humid and dry cure of CEB usually happens with blocks stacked on pallets. Bricks and blocks, panels and slabs, an infinite variety of density, shape, dimension and ingredients. Prefabrication has not spoken its last words in the earth building sector.